Have you ever wondered how much the Copper Queens got from the just ended Women's Africa Cup of Nations which took place in Morocco? Then you are not the only one. And wonder no more because we are going to give you the revealed statistics of how much each player got from the tournament. Now, the Copper Queens played six games in total. And among these six games, we had three games in the group stages and the same semi-final or quarter-final, then the third and fourth position game. Now, for the first game that we played, we played against Cameroon and because we drew that game, each player was able to come out with a $1,500 from the game. The second game that we played was played against Tunisia and since we beat Tunisia, each player was able to come out with an amount of $3,000 from that game. The third game as well was played against Togo and we were able to beat Togo and from that as well, each player got a $3,000. So in the group stages, the team was able to bag an amount of $7,500 each just in the group stages. In the next game we played, we played against Senegal and since we beat Senegal, we were able to get an amount of $3,500 from that game each for, for the players. And the next game we played was against South Africa, which we did not win, unfortunately, due to the circumstances that we saw were unfair and we lost for that game. So we did not get an amount from, for that amount for that game. Then the next game we played, which was the third and fourth position, was the one that we played against Nigeria. And the one that we beat Nigeria, we were able to bag an amount of $4,000 each from that game. So now put the amount together with the amount that they, each team member was able to get from coming from Zambia, they were given $1,500 each. So put everything in total, each player was able to get an amount of $16,500. So which amounts to about 264,000 kwacha in Zambian kwacha. Now this amount might not seem significant for footballers or sportsmen, but men and women, but as you know, this sport is just beginning. Women's sports has not been watched as much as men's sports, so we do not have as much coverage as a male sport. As you could see from the from the crowds in the in, in the stadiums, we had very few people who are watching. Apart from the games that Morocco was attending because they were host, their host, which was filled with the stadium, the other games we are just having a few supporters here and there, and these were maybe probably students or people working in the country, said country, you know. Now because of that. The tournament is not able to pay these people as much money as they could pay the male teams. So we hope that in the future this could change as more people are starting to watch the females football. So the Coppola Queens, when they went to the Olympics, they were able to bag an amount of $5,000 each just for qualifying to the Olympics. So we have not been told yet how much they were, they were, able, to, we were able to make for qualifying to the World Cup but i'm sure it should be more than five thousand dollars for each player now this amount this amount is motivating to these players and because of that they are actually going to play even much more and more and more because the more you give people money the more they become motivated so i hope that they become motivated and they win more games due to such kind of incentives now seven of these players were promoted who are in the army were promoted because of the service that they gave to the nation so which is a good thing and kudos to them kudos to their commander and uh, also kudos to the president who actually directly made a call to the Coppola Queens to console them for losing that game because they were not supposed to lose so Zambia has been performing well when it comes to the female football and these incentives are what make it worth it for them you know as much as it is nice for us to watch it is also worth it for them as they are getting something out of it so this is good for them and I hope that they should get more with time and uh, they make more money as they should due to their performance in general. Now thank you very much for watching. So we'll give you more updates on different things concerning the Coppola Queens and we do actually talk about many other things apart from football. We do talk about politics, we talk about entertainment in Zambia and all sorts of things. So stay glued, subscribe to the channel, watch our videos, share and comment. Do whatever you want, but don't forget to subscribe because support a brother here and we are one. So thank you very much for watching and God bless you.